Okay, welcome to this tutorial. This will cover the calibration of a disk probe. Now you can see from the picture we have a disk. Well, the information we need to know before we start is the diameter of the disk, also the length of the stud, and you can do this with a vernier or with a micrometer, and also how far away the stud is from the center of the stylus. This is going to be uh, an offset we need to enter. Okay, if we're going to build a probe, we're going to treat it like a star center using two offsets from the star center. Now I'm going to index it with the B axis because that lines the stud up with the X direction. So I'm going to choose B45, choose my module. Again, we're going to add an extension. Start as center five way. Now Z minus is actually the disc. So I'm going to add a new one. I'm going to give it a custom name so I know what it is. Enter the diameter and the length. Add that offset. Then I'll check on the direction and change that to the way it's pointing. And this is going to use that measurement from the center of the stud to the center of the stylus. And again, I'm going to give it a custom name. Now the diameter is the measurement I took over the stud. In this case, it was three millimeters. And the length is the distance from the center of the stair to the center of the stylus. Now if I right click on here and choose edit, we bring up the details. Now I need to click on this button here and calibrate it manually. So I need to make sure I probe the outside of the ball with the disc with five points, making sure I don't probe the corner of the disc. So this is done by hand using the joystick. Don't forget to vary the Z as you go around. And I'm also going to repeat this for the stud. So right click, edit, click on this icon. And now I need to measure the very small stud on the top of the ball, which is very difficult. You can see from the image, I'm trying to measure the stud on the very top of the ball. We can edit this later, so don't worry too much about accuracy. So I'm just going to edit down to measure three, which is what I measured it to. And we can alter the offsets between the bottom one or the stud and the disc. Okay, so please see the other video in terms of fine tuning our offsets.